from browser fingerprinting, we move to something that is, you know, that, that has been, that's pretty synonymous with web, right? Capture uses something called as HIP, or it's human interactive uh, proof, which the whole basis of Capture or the premise in which it's built is that humans are going to be better at solving visual puzzles than computers. Now, back in the day, 2003, when you had this Capture, you know, there was probably uh, machine learning wasn't as prevalent as it is now. So it was, it worked in what it wanted to do. It increased the price of scraping. However, now, as we've seen in the talks prior to this, solving such solving such visual puzzles is a breeze for computers. So they had to move to something like this. And for the life of me, I've not been able to solve this in the four or five, uh, four or five times that I've tried to do. So what's happening here is that computers have become so smart at solving puzzles. If they can solve something like chess, which is you know, more complex than the number of stars in the sky, something like this is a breeze. So this impacts user experience in a big way. So what, what is the guide to a scalable use of proxies? First of all, it's defining the traffic profile properly. Once you have that, you have to choose which type of solution is best for you. If you want to build it, if you want to buy it, but you should always have this in, in mind. Design the solution in order to get successful responses. That's the data that the business requires. Keep your infrastructure healthy. Keep the, the, the proxies healthy. Without proxies, you cannot get the data at scale. And be respectful to the websites. Do the proper analysis on the websites, what they can support and in order to, to be able to, to understand, if you don't have uh, websites, you won't have uh, a project. So that's how we are focusing the, the efforts of using proxies here uh, at Scripting Hub in order to get um, uh, traffic, in order to get web data at scale. You need to find, uh, you need to use proxies. It's really easy to get into the proxy world, it is really easy to buy proxies, it's really easy to connect them, but using, uh, using them right, understanding what is it that you want to achieve and get the proper solution, it is a challenging part, so thank you.